Title track, Scotty Beam, another one that got away from all. The title track. <laughs> don't do that. See? It's not the title don't, track. Don't, don't do it's that. not a title track at all. <laughs> don't do that. It's the title it's of the track. It's called Alfredo. <laughs> title track. <laughs> it's on title. Another one. Why they all get away from all? You need some of my pills? No. <laughs> oh, what? which I meant to ask. No. <laughs> That's definitely not the You don't want some of my pills. I meant to no. ask. I, I, no. Hold on, let me pause The, the ones that were set aside. <laughs> oh, I used those. <laughs> I had to re up for you. I re up. Oh, okay. I re up. I got cash on me now. Oh, come through. <laughs> Allegedly, come through. <laughs> Maul, what's up? Come through. You need some? No, I'm good. You sure? No, nah, Maul, you should try. I'm telling you. It's not like it's not like shrooms. So buddy. No. Buddy, Atlanta will never be the same. Why? Yo. <laughs> in this Atlanta shit. Y'all keep putting me in Atlanta. <laughs> Slinging dick pills is fucking hilarious. That's a hustle, though. <laughs> nah, them shit where, where have we come too far? They're not, they not the gas to... station ones. What you gonna do when you're a millionaire? Sling dick pills? Uh, that could make you a millionaire. <laughs> oh, Yo. my God. Nah, this is, this is new Freddie Gibbs. Brand new Freddie Gibbs. Gibbs did it again. He did it again. She making me mad on the low. <laughs> Stop fucking formulating perfect albums with different people. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? It's effortless. <laughs> okay. Let's call Freddie Gibbs, man. Let's see why he did Let's this. do it, man. Let's see why he doesn't know we're calling. <laughs> I just bought I just bought a in. bunch of bunch of merch to support independent hip hop. Nice. Some Alfredo. It was good merch. Really good merch. Yeah. This is six three at the sound of the beat video voice. Fam, fam. fam. Was Dang. that he Gibbs voicemail? on the voicemail? This nigga has a real voicemail. <laughs> <laughs> Loser. Let's try yeah, the one double more time call here. No shame. Sometimes you well, get sometimes a when you get Yeah, no, I understand. I'm fucking around. <laughs> All right, no. He's sending you the voicemail. Damn, I'm texting him now. <laughs> Answer the fucking phone. <laughs> All right, brand new Freddie Gibbs album. Freddie Gibbs Alchemist. Mm-hmm. Yes. Alfredo. Mm-hmm. Great name. Love Alfredo. I hate Alfredo, but love this album. You can't Al- hate Alfredo, man. I hate Alfredo. I can't believe it. It's a lot, Derry. Well, me and Maul has hips, yeah. so he probably don't want to eat Alfredo. <laughs> has, why do you keep saying that? Because the fans said that. No, you said that. The fuck are you talking yeah, you about? You swear I'm gay. <laughs> well, <laughs> fam, you right, said first that. First of all, every, everyone, that every human for the most part has hips. you think we're going to fight, though. Fam, you, <laughs> you said that, and I'm like, what are you talking about? <laughs> What'd you say, Warren? Every human for the most part has hips. It's okay. <laughs> no, but the way he was trying to say it. Everyone has hips. <laughs> Don't look at me. <laughs> I love when the Mixie Boys attack me. I love I even when the Mixie Boys attack me. I have not said anything. Freddie Gibbs, uh, Al- you said you hated Alfredo. No black person does that, man. It's just a lot of people hate He's Al- had a lot of IG chicks That's cooking the same true. Alfredo meal yeah, from the Alfredo same can. Alfredo is disgusting, first No, it's of not. That shit nah, is trash. You got to put broccoli in your shit, man. That shit trash. <laughs> you, ain't, you ain't had it with broccoli. Niggas swear they be <laughs> eating. Yo, you know when you find yeah, out when niggas don't eat good when you go to the house? The spinach. You be like, you don't eat good food. You ain't have somebody jazz it up for him. Alfredo is When last time a chick cooked for you, man? Let me get into you. Let me get into where your views come from. What they made? Alfredo. I only eat seafood. So like salmon. Seafood Alfredo. Yeah, you could do what seafood Alfredo. Salmon. Shrimp Alfredo. Shrimp. Shit like that. They veggies, make no sides like, for you? A lot, lot of veggies. That's why you act like that. You ain't got a chick that make you sides. What you mean? Rice? You just had shrimp and fucking no, scallops. Saying, that's you had bare Maul, scallop. Maul, Maul doesn't no... get the double starch. Yeah. Like two sides that yeah. shouldn't even be together. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't do that. <laughs> Yo, did y'all hear this Freddie Gibbs project? I yes. did. Two times I did. today. Heard it. Same. Heard it. Like it. Love it. Say his name. Frederick Gibbs. <laughs> <laughs> Alan the Chemist. Frederick. Alan the Chemist. He is Frederick. Alan the Chemist. Yo, really good project. Really good project from Freddie Gibbs. I've heard it. I've heard it about three times now. It's, it's really it's good. It's a real man. short, concise, 35 minute listen. See what I'm saying? Like, I love the 35. Alchemist yeah, put on a show. We gotta man. go 27 tracks and I all love the other I don't want to hear 27 tracks yeah, from you. Dudes. Like, from nobody. Right yeah, keep it right there. Just give me an experience real quick, boom, bam, and I'm out of there. Yeah, man. 
It's too much music. I don't need an hour and Freddie change for nobody. Freddie has been on a roll. So is Al. Yeah. And Al. I think we said it a few pods ago, but this is uh, it's just a really good project. I was telling y'all in pre-pro, we could take all the rapping off of this, and Alan the Chemist put on a 35-minute show. Yikes. But of, are we surprised? No. We notice about Alchemist. He's one of, I can speak for all of us, our favorite producers. For sure. Well, so when, the, when the wave of music changes, I'm, I'm on an island here. It's just Joe talking his own got thoughts. Got you, got you. Get your shit off. When the wave of music changes, like a few years ago when we were saying that the Justice, Justice League suffers because mumble rap is in or trap rap is in, mm. so they won't be able to get all those hardcore producers. You won't get all the placements off. Right. Right now. Right. Um, with Alan, Alan, with Alan the Chemist, He's Griseldang. He's Meaning. Grisel. He's been Me- doing that for a long time, though. Yeah, for quite some time. Yeah. I mean, he's been doing the one-off EP. But it don't. Him but and it, Prodigy. But it, it don't. Run. It don't matter. Currency. A bunch it, of people. I don't yeah. say it because it doesn't matter. What we be- all of us believe. Just Alan the chemist. That's what he does. Right. Just right. highlighting. Right. At any year that he's alive, he can do this. But it's, too. it's the timing yeah. of who he is and what he does with where the universe and the rest of the shit is that right now what he does is out of here like hood commercially mm-hmm. right like in a claimed world maybe yeah. not statistically right. but to the heads and the people that yeah this is Al's time to shine just like with Griselda the boom bap slower rap nah it's back now. Al, We're going to flourish really good. in this now. Al is really good at picking the rappers he knows he's going to mesh with on a full project. Well, Alan, like, he don't just be he ain't doing rap, shit. He ain't just going, and that goes back to the, we'll, we'll get to the let's build it, together dudes. But yeah. Alan, be a good segue. Alan is not trying to just work with no. all of y'all. And no matter, even if you're the more popping doing units rapper, which I know that comes across his table all the time. Nah, I'm cool. I'm going to do it with someone I know and make a music with. Actually, when we heard Crook and Joel's project hard, uh, one of the questions I left with was, why no Al? Hmm. Mm-hmm. Was it Only all because he he's active. It wasn't oh, no, 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 no. It wasn't all he makers. No, okay. Mostly I see he Ilman makers. on real there. Great, real great producers yeah. on here. Justice Eric League. Sermon. Apollo. Yeah, no, these are Justice all amazing League, producers. Ilman, Heat Makers. Uh, I can't read that. Boogeyman. Eric Sermon and Boogeyman. Heat Makers. Al's name belongs in this, and yeah. Al was active, but maybe he was. Al was on a sure, mission, he's, man. He's, I don't think that yeah. Al is really chasing, uh, like, getting a song on an album. Very no, aggra- no, 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 not very aggressively. It's, no. It happens. It's, but, it's installments. It's like yeah. capsules. Uh, even now. even what he did on the Hove and J Elect thing, he had said was years old. Like yeah. he had sent that to J Elect, like, yo. You fuck with this, yeah. Al. Send the pack over, man. I'm producing this small album. It's coming. <laughs> it's, fi- it's finally on the way. Streets get ready. <laughs> streets get ready. Tell the streets to get ready. Get ready. That's your prodigy. Oh, oh, yeah, get, get ready, man. <laughs> well, I would rap on an Alchemist album, though. Absolutely. <laughs> Mo could talk some shit over. It Absolutely. For Al. I actually Mo would talk- kill the keep it thorough beat. Hold up. Come on, Joe. Don't do that because you gonna. Put I don't know. Spot can Mo keep up with that beat? Can I keep up? Well, you know, well, I've been coming well, out That's, that's an aggressive beat, man. That, that pocket ain't ain't quick, man. Yeah, but more been thorough, though. Just come on now. <laughs> I'm going to let them talk about my legacy. You know, you don't, you don't talk about your legacy. Let the people talk about it. Right. Over the keep it thorough beat. <laughs> Specifically. Mm. Over just the all keep... my friends. Yeah, just... yeah, yeah. St. John, fall back. I got to do this for the city. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> for the city. Uh. Uh. It's Harlem. Who want problems? Mm. Uh, come on, Mo. <laughs> I don't rap, Joe. Sorry to disappoint you. But if you do. When you rap, I'm a rap. How about that? No, that's when, been our No, no, no. When you put out, when you put out a argument. verse, I'm going to put out a verse. But you got to put it, a far verse as, out. As far as that. No, no, don't, yeah. give that. don't give me that same vibe. Don't <laughs> save that recycled same recycled form. Don't give Because you really thought you did something. Joe, no, it's a 12 with that. Know, it's a 12 with that. Benny who? I can tell you. It's a 12. Benny who? I can tell. It's a 12 with the call Benny right now. That's why you so corny, because I can tell when you've been writing and you like what you wrote. Oh, yeah, yeah. Because you no. just start dropping nah, gems nah, nah, everywhere like you it. walk. He's like saying the same yeah, like, four, I like four it. days. Here no, that's shit, not true. Man. Actually, I was in the house this week trying to remember how I started the last time. What was that? What was that bullshit I was saying? I liked it, and I forgot it. 
Oh, I, you got yeah, that was hard though. See, okay. see was, and I don't remember now. Yeah, that was hard. Say, well, I had a big word. In it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, I was going on. It was that a one. Q word too, or something. Yeah. It wasn't. It wasn't a simple. Was it word. a quince? <laughs> it may have been a quince. I don't. I don't remember. But we got. We got to dig that Joe one back would up. Joe a quince in his return verse. <laughs> I For sure. He gonna dig into his Jeopardy bag. Heavy. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. What is a quince? <laughs> Oh man, y'all fucking listeners got me so self conscious about my laugh that now that I'm just doing some silent shit. Like, no, that was really <laughs> funny though. I don't know who that, who, who put that th- that together that laugh. That was you. No oh, wait, <laughs> be your own people. <laughs> Damn, so I thought it was like the internet, Joe. Oh, I Save on is the internet. I ain't in house. I he is the streets. Doing niggas a favor, just keep keeping the money flowing during the pandemic. <laughs> <laughs> like, niggas getting beside. Like, <laughs> Fuckers ain't, ain't miss a bill yet. Now all of a sudden. <laughs> now, now niggas is doing laugh edits. <laughs> That's oh, you hilarious. Play. <laughs> oh, you wanna play around, huh? <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> oh, what, what are we talking about, man? Sitting comfortable in the Yeezys yeah. during a pandemic. Oh, man. This nigga Freddie Gibbs. I'm going to try him one more time. I'm going to try him one more time. I'm just came out on the phone heavy. Yeah. yeah no, Do, he, doing he, the phoners? He, talking to Scotty Bean, nigga. And Cash Doll. What you going to do about it? <sighs> Damn, all. <laughs> You know, nigga talking like to all the dolls. Yeah, it'd be like that. <laughs> Scotty Beam is not a doll. <laughs> yeah, she is. <laughs> no, she's not. She's a beam. Yes, she is. She's an activist doll. <laughs> what are you looking at me for? That's my people. I fuck with Deonie. That's my people too. Doll. And Mall's people. And Parks people. All right, Freddie Gibbs don't want to talk though. That's fucked up. Clearly. Yeah, it's foul. But what a project. Real yeah, dope. What yeah. what what a project, man! Hats off, hats off to Freddie do, Gibbs. Do we think Gibbs gets his his just due as far as his flowers? Um, in the circles that I think he probably wants them, that he's aiming for, yeah, yeah. that he's aiming for. Because sometimes you got to know where you want your flowers from. It, it might just. He's been pretty fucking consistent. Yeah. yeah. Real nigga records. Real nigga speaking. How you doing? <laughs> what's the word, bro? Gibbs, what's going on, bro? How you feeling, man? Hey, man. Getting to it, man. I've so called you to drop this project. In the last 10 minutes, I've called you more than I've called any of the girls I like. <laughs> no way. No For real. Way. No For real. way. I don't, believe, I don't believe that, Joseph. Let's start with girls you like. The Scotty Bean track. <laughs> yes, yes. I, I like love it. it. Oh, you talking about the song? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you hey, no, yes, yes, relax. Yes. Yeah, he was ready to go somewhere. Yes, yes. yes. Why you did? Why you? Why you and Al did this, man? Hey, man. You know, I feel like it was needed, man. You know what I mean? Nobody was really doing nothing. You know, what I mean, we. I was working, so I was just like, man, it's, it's you know, it's time for you know something to come out. You know, and uh, I just wanted, I just wanted to do something special real quick. You know? I like that about rap music now. Yeah. You, you feel that way, yeah. you can just put something you just out. Do it. I, right. I like that. You putting together quite the discography. I got to be honest with you. Thanks. Thank you. I appreciate that. I was tired of niggas. Somebody had said on Twitter or some shit like, uh, like Freddie Gibbs only good on Mad Lib beats, and I was like, oh, okay, cool. You know what I'm saying? So one of them pussy ass niggas motivated me on Twitter. <laughs> so I well, was like, well, also I ask, what's wrong with being dope on Mad Lib beats? Yeah, right. <laughs> ain't that, ain't that, ain't, well, ain't nothing wrong with being dope on Mad Lib beats. I'm, I'm dope on any beat though. Of course, right? I just said that. I, the funny shit. I just said that to Parks. I'm like, this guy is just making great albums with different people. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, man, this is all about being versatile, dog. You know what I'm saying? And Al and, and, and Otis, they really, you know, bring something out of me. You know what I'm saying? That I, you know, they make me better as a rapper. You know what I mean? So that, you know, that trends in on the everything else I do. I like that this is 35 minutes, Freddie. I do. Like, this is a smooth Yeah, I don't, I don't like long albums, man. I don't like long albums. I hate when niggas give me 20 songs, and I'm like, what the fuck, man? Mm-hmm. You know, I don't, Nobody hear I that. feel like no. I got to read a, read a long-ass book. I don't want to do that, you know? Can't remember what records you liked. It's too much era to fuck up when yeah. it's forty minutes long. You definitely yeah. got three or four trash shits on your yeah. hour long album. Let me get my corny journalist question off. What was the inspiration behind this Scotty <laughs> Beam track? Um, you know what, man? Scotty <laughs> Beam, man, look at her, man. She was the inspiration. But uh really though, you know, I think that I named it that because I think that was just at the most climactic part of my verse, you know what I mean? And it just, you know, it came out like that. You think you got eight on that record? Uh, no, nah, I don't think I get eight on no records. I'm one of the best, you know, niggas uh, to to rap in a, in a recording booth. Nah, yeah, I don't think I get eight on no that's records. That's my bad, Fred. I just gotta ask the tough questions, buddy. Don't don't mind me. I don't think you got eight that's, either. That's, that's the tough question to a rapper. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm never gonna say I got eight. Yeah, yeah, 
Yeah, good point. Um, what else do I what else do I want to know about this album? What else do y'all want to know about this album? Uh who was the one feature on this album that you uh you felt like might have given you the most push, like as far as your pen, like you knew you had to really, really go hard? Um, you know, uh I mean, you know, everybody, you know, inspired me. You know, I probably I probably say Ross. Ross made me wanna, you know. Do something special, even though I did that song before. You know, before I sent it to him, I was mm-hmm. just like, you know, I wanted to do something. Damn, get off Scotty so, Dick. Know, All right, but hold on. But but, but Fred, be be honest. You said you you said you did that verse before you sent it to him. When you got Ross verse back, did you change anything? Mm. Not, never. I never do that. I ain't never. Who I look like? Uh, L- Cannabis, LL Cool J. What I look like, man. I don't do no <laughs> like that. Did you record this album yourself because of the quarantine, or did you go out to? Uh, That's cheap, spot? man. I don't do that. Go ahead. I said, did you uh, record the album yourself, or did you go out to Al's spot to do it? Did the quarantine make you record it? Say what? He said, did you record the album yourself, or because uh, because of quarantine, or did you and Al get together and do it? Oh, me and me and my boy Rich, we recorded it at my crib, and you know, we went to Al. I went to Al's spot a couple days. You know, it was not. I, I, we both in L.A., so it was just you know, you know, driving you know twenty thirty minutes, going back and forth to the spots. Oh, okay. You know? oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Tell me about tell me about the decision to put the the Benny and Conway features on different songs. Um, streaming. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. You, you mm. want to be honest? You nah, know what smart. I mean? it's, you know, it's kind nah, of better to spread and work out a little bit. No, I think, you know? actually, I'm 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 going to challenge that. Well, okay, maybe not from a streaming Thank standpoint, you. but I, you know, from an artistic standpoint, I, yeah. him on, I, I heard him on that song, and I heard him on that song. Dude, so. No, no, you could do stream from that standpoint that the strictly Griselda fans are now running to two records instead of one. Correct. If you're grabbing just that fan, yeah, for streaming which, purposes, I can which, see that. Which doesn't dent streaming at all. I, that's at rel- all. It's, it's relative. That's a fact. It's relative to. No, it's a fact. You're not doing that for streaming. You're doing it because you like the niggas. No, nah, it's, it's relative. Yeah, that's real. I just like them. Niggas. Yeah, you like the niggas. I like the niggas. We all like the niggas. They're yeah, not like, about like to break niggas. your streaming yeah. shit. That's not. No, a, that's I, not an insult. I'm not. I'm not <laughs> saying the numbers. I'm. I'm not saying the influx of people that would go. I'm just saying. I'm not saying I did it for more. I'm saying I put them on separate songs to stream. They're going to two know? different yeah, songs now instead of one. Features instead of putting it all. You're talking about a volume game. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about just strictly the Griselda fan that just loves Griselda. 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 Now I'm going to two songs on Get Shit instead of one. That's what I'm saying. No, I'm not saying a volume game. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. There you go. You got the right idea. <laughs> Fred, you follow a lot of skinny bitches on the gram. So you said I hook a lot of skinny bitches? You follow, not fuck. I would never do that on a public platform. You follow a lot of the skinny ones out there. Like, But when you get I away from that bag... No, you follow. I don't, I don't know if you know them in real life, but you follow them on Hold Instagram. Hold on, you breaking up. You... Oh, my phone. My bad. Oh, shit. Yeah. You hear me now? Yeah, I hear you now. I said you follow a lot of skinny chicks on the gram. Would you like to speak to that? Lot, I, I follow a lot of fat bitches too. Now, come on, though. that's not <laughs> no, 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 no. That's that. No, that's when we get in that same bag. We get in that same bag on the fat bitches with the skinny ones. I'm like, damn, Fred like her too. Yeah, I be yeah. I like a well, if, if it don't if it don't got a Joe Budden stamp on it, then I don't like it. I got a Joe Budden like. It. <laughs> Yo, you and New Jersey twerk, man. We all we we gotta got similar tastes out there. All right, so what's that's happening? A, that's a sick tree. Yeah, no, no, nah, but twerk like a twerk. What up, twerk? Jersey niggas run you niggas. Ask twerk. Ask twerk. Um, hey Gibbs. So so pandemic. We can't tour right now. Like how right. do how do we promote music? I mean, you know, sell a lot of merchandise, and you know. I think you got to have that core fan base, man. You know what I mean? And, um, you know, since we can't tour right now, you just got to be innovative, I think. You know what I mean? Instagram making buttons and shit where they about to make let niggas get paid. So I think that's mm-hmm. cool. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? Um, I think that shit going to open up within the next two or three months anyway. You know what I mean? And, mm-hmm. you know, I think it's you know it's going uh, over well in Europe and stuff like that. I got motherfuckers over there hitting me to do shit. So I think I'm going to be up and running, in, you know what I mean, within a couple months. I ain't tripping at all. You know what I mean? I wasn't worried about the, you know. Well, you rich already, time. nigga. Yeah, just like you. I'm trying to be like you. Man. <laughs> <laughs> my final question, I can't speak for my crew, because I all I wanted to know was why you and Al went crazy like this. But my final question <laughs> is, in the event that I am tricked into recording again, can I send you a beat? Yes, yeah. You owe me a verse anyway. I know, so I know. We can do a swap. 
I know that was my. Problem. I hated swaps. <laughs> that was a real thing. Yeah, that was like a real swaps thing. Is kind of trash, yo, yo, swap. We gotta one day have a real conversation <laughs> about swaps. Freddie Gibbs can Freddie Gibbs can always get a swap from Joe, right. but it's a few of these right. other niggas yeah. that be talking about a swap. Like, yeah. fam. Oh yeah. Nah, I'm cool. Yeah, yeah, I'm all right with. Yeah, that. some yeah some niggas be trying to swap. I'd be like, nah, I can't swap shit. You know. Yeah. So I get it. Yeah. Listen, man, if you speak to uh, Alan the chemist before me, hug him, tell him I love him. You guys did what, yeah. what you've been doing for a little while now. I'm not surprised at all, and I want to thank you. Thank you for it. Man, I thank y'all for, you know what I mean, for fucking with it and, you know, loving the project, man, for real, dog. We got more on the way, too. It ain't over with. Anytime. Listen, man, as soon as we can fly again, you know what me and you doing the strip clubs. We'll get it back. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> hey, my birthday next month, man. My birthday next month, I'm going to Miami, so come fuck with me. Might be a good trip. I will, t- I will talk to you <laughs> off of off of the line. We will talk Freddie Gibbs. <laughs> Just say, the, say the word. I dig dog. My nigga love. Love. Hey, yeah, we're back on. That was a good call. Real good call. Shout, Shout out to Gibbs. Gibbs wow. underrated with with his his girl shit. He be getting into on records. Yeah. Gives he talking Gives shit. Is putting he, quite he the what doing, man. together, man. Boy, the temperature has changed on him from when I first heard his name with all that Jeezy bullshit to now. Uh-huh. Yeah. Like, he's carving out quite the path for himself. That's no, so he's been funny. around for, it's for a while. It's yeah. identifiable. Yeah, but he is identifiable now. Uh-huh. Like, he's arrived. Like, don't play with him. Yeah, and people, I don't think people really put his name next to the Jeezy thing anymore at all. Well, yeah, you got to work like your way. All. You got to work your way out of that stuff, mm. and and he did that. He yeah. made he made decisions. He stuck with them, and they worked. So shout out to Gibbs. I love Gibbs. Bump into him in the local strip club. We have a blast, man. So can't <laughs> can't, can't wait to get back to that. And there's something to that. Like when you're in a strip club and you can look to the side and a rapper nigga walk in there and you can just see what's going on. Like I may be in a bubble here. There is something to that. Well, we're not rappers, so we don't. As far as what meaning, like when it's a cool, like you find out he's a cool dude. Yeah, he has a lot of like. Yeah, you like well, you just like how a niggas moving around. He's in the same spaces. You see what's going on. Mm-hmm. Like this, this it's, it it ups your stock. Yeah, somehow. Yeah. Same way when you meet a rapper and he's an asshole and it mm-hmm. burns the stock.